guys, today we're going to make pancakes, but not just any pancakes, the best pancakes in the world. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to make delicious pancakes. And you might say, I like waffles, not pancakes. Well, my friend, pancakes are way better than waffles. The only time waffles can be better than pancakes, if they're bubble waffles, they're delicious. The ice cream, the toppings. But today we're going to talk about pancakes. Don't give me off toppings. Very funny. Okay, now I'm going to show you the ingredients for my mom's pancakes. We'll need at least three bananas, some olive oil, about three cups of yogurt, the same with um, flour, a mixing bowl and a mixer, two to three eggs, and a cup like always. First, we're going to mix a pancake recipe with bananas. Yes, bananas. It might sound weird, but I assure you it's delicious. It's bananas. First step, we're going to need two to three eggs and a big mixing bowl. Make sure not to get any shells. Okay, now we're going to mix the eggs there so they'll be nice and fluffy and yellow. Okay. Now we're going to have about two to three cups of yogurt. Now we're going to mix. Okay, so uh, we're going to add the yogurt uh, as milk. Because if you couldn't eat pancakes because of the milk, this is for you. Okay, let's, now let's continue with the recipe. And make sure to wash and dry your cup before you add the flour. Remember, only add about two or three cups because you don't want them to be too stiff. So, now let's pour and mix. So there are no lumps left. Okay, the fun part. Let's get three beautiful bananas into very thin slices. Now, we have to put the bananas into the mix and stir really lightly and gently so we don't mash anything up. When we're done mixing, we'll proceed to the other fun part, the baking. Oh my god, we travel back in time to the kitchen. This is my pan. Grown-ups have big pans, but since I'm only 10, I get the little one. Now we're going to turn on the fire and make it to a desired heat. Remember not to let any small children go near the pan while you cook. Now we're going to add a small little dribble of olive oil and put it around the pan. So I'm going to use a small ladle to scoop dough and a banana and pour it in the pan so you could bake to a small little pancake. It has to turn yellow and crispy and then you can turn it around. Okay, so here's a plate of freshly baked pan banana pancakes. They're soft, fluffy, and they're delicious. They're just like cookies. Okay, today I'm going to show you the ingredients to make my dad's pancakes. First, we're going to need two teaspoons of honey, some olive oil, about three cups of milk, and the same with flour. 
I need three big round eggs, a mixing bowl and a mixer, and a cup for measuring. So I'm back, and now we're gonna make my dad's recipe. They're the best big round flat pancakes. So let's start. First, we're going to need three big eggs, both yolk and whites, and a big mixing bowl. Don't want to get any shells. Oh no, I got a shell. I have to take it out now. All good, the shell is out. Now let's mix. Now is honey time, the best time of day. Now. You want to add either one tablespoon or two teaspoons of honey, depending on how sweet you want it to be. Now we stir so the, the honey is all gone. And it's melted. Then let's mix the eggs with some delicious milk. Well, what do I know? I'm not lactose intolerant. So we're going to add three cups of milk to make it nice and soft. Time is for to add the flour. We add three cups of flour and mix really well. The dough is ready, so it's time for time travel to the kitchen. Oh my god, time travel works like so well. Well again, this is my pan. Let's turn up the temperature. We can actually cook and make the, the fire smaller so it won't burn. Again, please uh, leave kids that are younger than 10 years old out of the room and add a little smidgen of olive oil. Now, let's wait for the temperature to get hot. Here we go. Now we just have to wait for it to turn golden on the other side. Once we see that the edges are curling and kind of baking, that means that it's, we have to turn it over soon. Let's turn. We have to find the edge where it's unstuck. And we can use a fork to help us. A little thing is broken off, but we can fix that. Now we just have to wait for the other side to cook. Ladies and gentlemen, these are going to be the last pancakes we're going to make today, but they are the best. I'm telling you, the best. Big round flat pancakes you've ever tasted in your life. Now, bon appetit, enjoy, and I told you they're excellent. Pancakes was basically everything: butter, fruit, cream, jam, peanut butter. Yeah, pancakes was basically everything but veggies. Dun dun dun. My favorite is cream with blueberries on top. Some of the best toppings by popular vote is drum roll please, maple syrup, closely followed by Nutella. And some people think to put Nutella on pancakes, like, who are those people? I say I don't like Nutella.
Before you come for me, I just want to say I was allergic to chocolate for most of my childhood, so I'm not used to chocolate or Nutella. My classmates' favorite toppings are honey, strawberries, and raspberries. My teacher's favorite pancake topping is bacon. Personally, I never tried bacon in my life. I'm never, ever, ever eating bacon, ever. Guys, thank you for watching. If you like the pancakes and the video, please like and subscribe.